The upcoming GTR has to be one of the most anticipated super sports cars in recent times. Nissan has been working on a complete model redesign for its flagship sports car for a while now. Looking back at Nissan's history, the Skyline GTR, which has long been the icon of Nissan's sports cars lineup, is currently in the third generation of models with the GTR name, following the first generation from 1969 to 1973 and the second generation from 1989 to 2002. With 14 years after its release in 2007, the current Nissan GT-R R35 is one of the Japanese automakers' vehicles with the longest product cycle. Over the years, Nissan has made slight improvements to this Japanese treasure, giving the GT-R numerous facelifts over the years. A new model is now long overdue. The best car scoop team from Japan, has scoured the web for scoops on the upcoming Nissan GT-R, and they have received some interesting news. It's the most recent information on the highly anticipated GT-R R36. What's the scoop? The new GT-R is being developed with a gasoline turbo engine, after all, defying prior rumors that it would be outfitted with a mild hybrid engine. So, what will become of this illustrious sports car? We've got lots of the latest stuff you don't want to miss, from rumors about the power plant to the design of the forthcoming GTR. The next R36 GTR won't be coming anytime soon. What is the reason for the delay? What are the challenges of the next GTR? Well, Nissan says, we have to wait patiently, environmental regulations are hurting the future of sports cars. When Top Gear contacted Mr. Philip Klein, Nissan's product planning executive, and asked him about the next generation R36 GTR, he replied, yes, you guys have to be patient, because we will meet your expectations. The driving experience is a high priority, and as we move from gasoline engines to hybrids, nothing will be lost in the fun of driving, even if we go electric. Initially, Best Car got information claiming that the present model will be phased out in the fall of 2022 and that a mild hybrid powertrain based on the VR38 DETT engine will be installed on the next model. Despite the future strict emissions and noise rules, the next model is being designed to accommodate a gasoline turbo engine, rather than a mild hybrid system, according to fresh information. The improved 3.8-liter V6 twin-turbo engine is also projected to produce 600 horsepower and 480 foot-pounds of torque, similar to the current GTR Nismo.